What's up, you guys? My name is Mary. I'm with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel and you enjoy my content, you can smash the sub button to be notified for future readings. This is free general collective reading for all signs, cats, and side to everybody in between. Don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, let it fly. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages that resonate with the rest. Free general collective reading. Love and appreciate each and every one of you guys. Um, thanks for all the new subscribers and thanks for all the shares of my content. It's really helping um, get uh, it around to people that do not know about my channel or my business. And um, it's helping the view count go up tremendously. So thanks so much for all the love and support to the channel. I really, really, really appreciate it, you guys. Okay, so um, this is a free collective reading. So only take the message or messages that resonate. Leave the rest. Up. We're teetering 15,000 people on this channel. So you really have to take the message or messages that resonate. Leave the rest. Okay. All right. So the channel message I received was, there's about to be a very significant, and I heard uh, unexpected, unexpected death in a um, lawyer's life soon and a Sagittarius's life soon. Um, I heard this unexpected um, death is about to open up this lawyer and the Sagittarius's life, uh, their eyes, their eyes in a huge way. And um, it's about to make them speak on a stolen inheritance. They never thought they would speak on. You plug it in how it resonates. It's very interesting. So there's an upcoming death in the universe. Now, of course, you only take the messages that resonate with the rest. I feel for a lot of you guys, you probably know this Sagittarius or this lawyer, or you're about to hear about this death. Uh, you plug it in how it resonates. Um, however, that resonates and applies, okay? But it's an unexpected death coming, so I don't feel this person is like on hospice care or anything of that nature. Um, it is an unexpected death. Nobody's going to see it coming. So I don't feel this person is like on hospice care or something. Um, nobody sees it coming. And I feel it's two different energies. I heard a lawyer and a Sagittarius. So I feel the lawyer could be a Sag for some of them. If you're the lawyer and this resonates for you, you might be a Sag. But I feel there's two energies. I feel it's a lawyer and a Sagittarius. For some, it could be Sag lawyers. You plug it in how it resonates. But the Sag could have Sag in any aspects of their charts. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Ortho, Moon, Hammer, Jupiter charts. But it's unexpected death. And I heard basically when the death occurs, it's going to give the lawyer and the Sag such a huge wake-up call that they're going to reveal information on a, um, on a, um, uh, on a stolen inheritance they never thought they would. So you plug it in how it resonates. One of these unexpected deaths is going to be a very young adult air sign. Okay, I heard keep it. One of these unexpected deaths is going to be a very young adult air sign. One of these um, unexpected deaths is going to be a very young adult air sign. So very young adult air sign, I take that as like 18 to 25. So I'm presuming, and this hasn't happened yet. The death hasn't happened yet. We got, I heard keep it, we got child reverse. So this is a very young adult air sign death is what I'm presuming here. Um, they're not a child anymore. They're not a minor energy anymore. They are an adult. So I'm feeling 18 to 25. This younger air sign. I feel it could be a masculine fem air sign. They could have Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, and any aspects of their charts. Uh, one of the deaths is going to be a younger adult, very young adult air sign. Child reverse. They're not a minor. They are an adult. 18 to 25 air sign. Masculine or fem air sign. Gemini, Libra, or Aquarius air sign. They could have Gemini, Libra, or Aquarius, and any aspects of their charts. Whoever they are. Yikes. Spirit messages to your collective. This is going to cause chaos in a community. Chaos. These deaths. Oh, I heard deaths like plural. So uh, two or two plus deaths. And that would make sense because we are pulling two energies, at least two energies, a lawyer and a Sagittarius. So at least two deaths. But one of them is a very young, adult air sign energy. Gemini Libra Aquarius. Spirit. 
but it's going to, it's going to cause, um, it's going to cause the lawyer or the sag to reveal information on a stolen inheritance they never thought they would. Despair. I think this lawyer or the sag is going to be in despair over this death. Now, I didn't hear the connection of the younger. There's at least two deaths here, but one of them I'm picking up very strong is a younger air sign energy, adult air sign energy, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius energy, masculine or femme. I don't know the connection on that energy to the side or the lawyer. Only they would know the connection of this younger air sign adult energy that's about to pass away. Only they would know the connection they have with this person. But I think the side or the lawyer is going to be in despair over this. Um, they are going to be in severe despair. For one, it is their grandchild. For one, it is their child. Oh my God, I heard they're going to be in severe despair over this. In one of these situations, it is their child. In one of these situations, it is their grandchild. So you plug it in how it resonates. Um, for some of them, it, they may, it might not be their child or grandchild. But in some of these situations, it is their child. So their biological or foster child. And one of these situations is their grandchild, either a biological or a foster grandchild. You plug it in how it resonates, but um, they're going to be in severe despair because they're either, for some of them, it's either their biological or foster grandchild or biological or foster child. But for some, it may not be their grandchild or child. But severe despair here, shock energy here. I heard put this back. We have course ship reverse. I heard put it back. But they're going to be in dis severe despair. And at once, very successful Scorpio is about to lose it all. Okay, I shuffled three times. I got this all three three times, and I got it previous. Um, and I heard a once very successful Scorpio is about to lose it all. So whoever this Scorpio is, mask or fin Scorpio, they could have Scorpio in any aspects of their charts, but they're about to lose it all. So whoever this Scorpio is. Number 32, despair. The Scorpio is going to be in despair. They were once very successful. They're about to lose it all. So they're going to be very in despair because they're about to lose it all. I didn't hear how. Severe gambling addiction here. Severe gambling addiction here. So they have a severe gambling addiction. The Scorpio has a severe gambling addiction. So this uh, Scorpio that was once very, very, very successful, they're about to lose it all, but they have a severe gambling addiction and sex addiction and sex addiction. They have a severe gambling and sex addiction. So I'm assuming they're probably about to lose it all financially is what I'm presuming. Some kind of gambling situation. Or they contract HIV or something and their health just declined so terribly, how that resonates and applies. Um, I didn't hear they had HIV or anything like that, but I did hear sex addictions and gambling addictions. So you plug it in how it resonates. Judication upright. Poor, oh my God, courthouse upright. Number 30 or 23 could be very significant numbers in one's life. Number 30 or 23, it could be a possible age of you or somebody you're connected to or any other significant number. Number 30 or 23.
and someone <clears throat> that took some of this money from the stolen inheritance, they are majorly depressed, majorly depressed. Through many series of chain of events, they're going to end up taking their life. It's about to cause a huge ass investigation into this toxic family and the past. And it's not going to go well for these people. Okay, see, oh my God, this is terrible. And someone that suffers from major, I heard major depression. So it's not just, you know, everybody goes through depression every now and then. Things that happen, power moments that happen in their life. It's how you get up and cope and deal with it. Coping mechanism skills. But whoever this person is, and I didn't hear a sign or age or anything on this person, but they took some of the stolen inheritance money. From somebody I think from you for one of you guys you got your inheritance stolen uh, but somebody took some stolen inheritance money and they're suffering from major depression so not just regular depression major depression I heard through many series of chain events they're about to take take their life so they are about to commit some kind of suicidal type situation here um, and I heard uh, this is the death is going to cause a huge investigation into the toxic family with the stolen inheritance. And I heard that is going to um, go badly for this family because I think the death is going to bring out the stolen inheritance money and the dirty dealings of this toxic family is what I'm feeling. That and so much more. Okay, I heard that and so much more. So, it's, yeah, it's going to bring out the stolen inheritance money and so much more. But whoever is about to pass, okay, so we have the younger heir sign about to pass away. Shocking. And we have somebody else is what I'm feeling. It might be the same person. It might be a different energy. But somebody else that um, suffers from major depression and they're about to pass away, they're on hands. Um, now, how they do it, I don't know. But it sounds like they possibly already have suicidal ide ideations now or they're about to occur uh, or about to occur and they're about to take their own life basically um and that's going to cause a huge investigation into this family and because it was all about money it was all about stealing your inheritance if this resonates for you so it's going to cause uh an investigation probably criminal situation here with the stolen money legal issues here i mean we have adjudication with courthouse I mean, that's a bad combination for a toxic family and stolen inheritance and a death um, of somebody that stole some money that had major depression. Um, it is going to be a very gruesome death. And it's going to be all over the news. And it's going to be everywhere. Oh my God, this is terrible. I heard it's going to be a very gruesome death. It's going to be all over the news and it's going to be everywhere. Somebody needs to get this person some help. Um, I'm serious. They suffer from major depression. I heard it's going to be a very gruesome death. It's going to be all over the news and it's going to be everywhere. So um, I think that the family is going to be in for a shit storm. A shit, negative shit storm when this happens. The family is going to be in for a negative shit storm when this happens. So the family is going to be in for a negative shit storm when this happens, when the death occurs. Yeah, somebody needs to get this poor person some help. I don't know if they're a young adult, uh, older adult, but they suffer from major depression and they're about to take their life. I'm feeling they probably already have suicidal ideations is what I'm presuming. I heard it's going to be a very gruesome death. This person has been blackmailed and they have been bullied by their family for years and it's about to mentally take the best of them. This is terrible. This is terrible. I heard this person has been bullied by and blackmailed by their family for years and it's about to mentally take the best of them. So it's about, they're about to take their life because they've been bullied and blackmailed by their family for years. But yeah, they got money, but they got somebody stolen money. That That's never good. Hopefully this person can mentally get past it and turn the money into the police or tell somebody and help them turn the money into the police or something. This is terrible. Um, but it's mentally getting to them because they're being bullied and blackmailed. I heard for years by their family. So they feel 
that they're not they're worthless and they can't don't have a voice basically because they can't speak up because they have somebody else's stolen money. This is terrible. I heard they're about to take it out on their, their own selves. But it's about but once they do, it's gonna create a series of chain of events very negatively for the toxic family. It's about to negatively boomerang back on the family. Someone will be charged with the death in this family. The death of this person. Because of the past. Okay, I heard it's going to negatively boomerang back on the family. And it's going to, uh, <clears throat> in the end, it sounds like somebody's going to actually be charged with the death of this person. Because of all the bullying and blackmailing and stealing of somebody else's inheritance. Probably your inheritance. I heard they suffer from major depression. This is terrible. So criminal charges here. Charger charges for a death. Yeah. Well, that's what you get when you steal somebody else's stolen inheritance. And that's just the truth. This is terrible. All right. I'm going to close it here and see if I hear anything else. I didn't. I didn't hear anything else. All right. I love you guys so much. I hope this helps. Namaste.